first thing you want to do before working on any electrically driven air compressor is to make sure the compressor itself is turned off. The power to the compressor is turned off and if possible that the air compressor is unplugged from the power service. Once you feel you're sure that you've turned off the power to the compressor and disconnected any additional power sources that might operate the air compressor. In this video, we will go over service components on the RS3 air end. We will now repair or inspect the minimum pressure valve on the RS3 air end.